I'm not sure which one's for gas, which one for electric, okay. but they're just breakers will be kicked out. Okay. Here again, I recommend you drain your water heater every time you're done with it. Okay. That's six gallons of water coming in that lemon tank, and they're getting things funky. It takes an inch and a sixteenth socket. Okay. Uh, and that's a long sacrificial rod, anode rod. Okay. So when you pull it out, it's going to look all deformed. Just take a wire brush and kind of clean it off lightly. Okay. When it gets to a size of just a little bit bigger than a pencil lead, you'll see the core at the end of it, and it's time to replace it. Okay. And I can just come here and yes. get the parts? Absolutely. Call, yeah, call, they're, call they're, you, order them, have them send them to me? Absolutely. That, that type of thing. Yeah, absolutely. Um, do you have propane at home? Have you ever messed with propane appliances before? We we do not have propane. Okay. Yeah. For some reason, I don't know why nobody does. Mud daubers and spiderwebs love the smell of propane. Really? Oh, it's crazy. <laughs> our, probably probably fifty percent of our water heater problems and furnace problems is a spider web or a mud dauber. Okay. Wow. They make a mud dauber screen that goes over this. Uh huh. And they make one for the furnace exhaust. Right. They'll save you a ton of headache. I've seen those. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. And they're twenty dollar parts. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, and they're and they're just held on with us with a spring, right? You got it exactly right, my yeah. friend. You're exactly right. Yeah, from Camco. I've seen them. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Once a year, twice a year, depending on how much you use this, take an air hose and blow your burner assembly out. Okay. And also your burner chamber inside there. Do stand back and just gonna blow black soot out everywhere at you. Uh, but that's that's great little service advice. Just keep that thing clean. Okay. okay. Any questions on the water here? No, I think. It I'll do it again. Yeah, here you go. So you said <laughs> when, when we go to drain, we yes, just sir. we just uh, you know unscrew that, and that's the anoid. Anode, right? Yes, sir. The anode, and that that will that'll drain. No, I kind of I, I, I went one step ahead of me. Always open the pop off valve before you pull that out. Okay. Because of pressure. Oh. Okay. Otherwise, if you don't, that thing will come flying out of there. Okay. Okay. So open pop off valve, then pull your anode drive. Okay.